I was just going to get some more champagne. Who was on the phone? No one. Who was on the phone, Whitney? You knew who I was. Right from the start. You followed me. You got to know me for months. You, sp you spoke to Tiff at the wedding. You followed me to Turkey. And we just... I'd like to leave, please. You never said. Never said he had a son. It doesn't matter what he said. Here I am. And what? You want revenge? Why would I want revenge? Hmm? Because we're the family Tony left you for. No. He never cared about any of you. Then what do you want? I want the truth. What happened is what happened. You don't have to lie, Whitney. I know everything. I read every transcript from the trial, every article, every little piece of information I could find. So you know what I went through? Oh, yeah. Oh, he made you love him. Yeah. One step wrong, he'd hurt you with a look. Or you'd be crushed for days. Yeah, I read it all, yeah. Heartbreaking stuff, even on the page. I can't imagine what it was like to live it. Now, you trusted him and, and he did that to you. It was awful, wasn't it? Yes. But then you tried to visit him, didn't you? Before he was convicted. Yeah. You applied for a visiting order to see him. Why did you do that? I don't know. I think you do. You felt guilty for lying. <laughs> what? You wanted to apologise for fitting him up. No. Here's what happened. You know, you and my dad, you had a relationship, fine. Yeah, nothing illegal, nothing until you were 16. But Bianca, yeah, she couldn't handle that. She couldn't handle losing a boyfriend, couldn't handle that he didn't want her. So she invented this whole story to get revenge on a guy that didn't love her anymore. She bullied you into backing it up. She made you say that he abused you. My dad, you know, an innocent man, he goes to prison <laughs> where he kills himself. That is not what happened. Yes, it is. And today, you're going to confess it. No, I ain't. Whitney!